Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Windows 11 is currently rolling out worldwide and Microsoft is using a controlled rollout for the release of Windows 11. And as many of you know, and I have posted in numerous videos previously, um, can, uh, Windows 11 can only be installed on a supported hardware that meets the minimum hardware and system requirements uh, of the Windows 11 operating system. Now Microsoft has also said that Windows 11 can be installed on unsupported um, hardware at your own risk using um, the media creation tool and the Windows 11 ISO image file. And But the only problem with this though is that they say that you will not be eligible for any future updates um, that roll out for Windows 11. So basically you're running an unsupported uh, um, operating system at your own risk. Now it's quite obvious that at the core Windows 10 and Windows 11 are really the same operating system and the only real difference is that Windows 11 has a lot more design improvements which and it's just, just been visually redesigned over Windows 10 but at the, the, the base of it they are more or less the same operating system. Now although this is the case Microsoft as many of you know is still uh, enforcing these hardware requirements uh, that require you uh, to be able to upgrade or install Windows 11 and they say this is due to, uh, to security and for security reasons. Now they have in the last uh, couple of days over on YouTube uh, posted this video um, Windows 11 security our hacker in chief runs attacks and shows solutions and it's about 17 minutes long and they basically give the reasons why in this video they are enforcing the security uh, the hardware requirements for security reasons and um, with the Windows 11 operating system and I will leave a link down below to this video if you are interested. Now basically the main security features uh, they are saying um, as many of you know by now are the trusted platform module TPM version 2 secure boot and virtualization based security and Microsoft says this is only found in newer devices and older devices are not being supported because they don't have these security features according to Microsoft. Now Microsoft also says uh, in the video that most computers built in the uh, over the last five years should be able to run uh, Windows 11 and I quote if a machine is attacked Windows 11 will stop these types of attacks out of the box because we're using secure boot and trusted boot which use both the required UEFR and TPM hardware. And as I did mention in a previous video, um, older unsupported PCs that don't meet the hardware and system requirements um, of Windows 11, when Microsoft did uh, run and test Windows 11 on these older PCs, um, they say that um, these older unsupported PCs can have 52% more blue screens than those that meet the uh, system requirements as well. So basically that's just a summarized version of the video and I will um, post a link down below to that video if you're interested. I hope you found this video useful guys. Once again thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.